remove the cap seal. Then carefully cut away the bottom part. Soldering irons reach temperatures in excess of what is needed to heat plastic. So press the tip using light pressure to melt the holes. Sawdust's a great substrate for oyster mushroom cultivation. Add water and combine. Sawdust is absorbent and needs to be moist, but not sopping wet. Its fine texture doesn't form clumps. Fill the primary layer with sawdust. Then add a layer of crumbled grain mycelium. Continue this layering process. The grains provide nutrients for the mycelium to grow and develop. Spray with water to ensure the substrate remains moist. Did you know oyster mushrooms are one of a few carnivorous mushrooms? They feed on bacteria and small round worms to obtain nitrogen for growth. After replacing the bottom section, seal together. This ensures a warm environment and steady temperature to preserve moisture. The containers remain sealed until the mushroom pins form. Store in a warm, dark place. Away from direct sunlight, but with fresh air. Spray water into the holes, but not excessively. It's vital that the substrate doesn't dry out. Mushrooms thrive in humid conditions with good air circulation. Oyster mushrooms have antiviral, antibiotic, and antifungal properties. They also provide antioxidants, which help reduce cellular damage in your body. Around two days later, check their progress. The mycelium will have started to colonize. Mycelium is a fungus which looks like fuzzy white threads growing through the substrate. Once it turns fully white, mushrooms will start to form. Now, remove the caps for improved air circulation. After 20 days, check if they're ready to harvest. Harvest the mushrooms before the edges of the caps flatten out or flip up.
The easiest and best way is to use a sharp knife. Cut them off as close to the mushroom block as possible. These are versatile mushrooms that accompany a variety of foods. Use them in meals like soups, stews, pasta dishes, and stir fries. Unlike many fungi, oyster mushrooms aren't seasonal. With the right conditions, they can be grown all year round. These mushrooms are known to improve gut health. The dietary fiber acts as a prebiotic and supports probiotic gut bacteria. Here's an amazing fact. Oyster mushrooms are excellent at absorbing toxins from the environment. They've been used to clean up oil spills and to decontaminate soil. No wonder the demand for these mushrooms is growing. Thanks for watching. See y'all next time.